Right, yeah, it's clutched down to start. and then. Uh, so what we've got here essentially is a 3.8 litre flat six engine. Obviously engine's mounted to the rear uh, and it's four wheel drive. When this car was originally launched it was two wheel drive on a four body shell, but now obviously with it being on a four body shell it's logical to put the four wheel drive system. It's predominantly rear wheel drive, but it can put up to 50% forward if the rear wheels start to lose grip. Okay, Same so, but, power output as the old two wheel drive, isn't it? As the old two, yeah, yeah. Well, no, we've 408 brake horsepower here, so we've given it a little bit more. Mm. Normally, the, the uh, Gen 1, Gen 2, 997 would be 385, which is a little bit more power. Right. You get the nice trim level as well, the Alcantara trim. We've got three three features on this car. We've got a sport button. Now, when we activate that, it sharps up, sharpens up throttle, uh, so it gives you more engine power on a short throttle, feels a bit more dynamic. We've got Porsche Active Suspension Management. It puts that to a firmer setting. So the car will feel more planted, a bit less body roll on corners under acceleration and braking as well. And we've also got sports exhaust system. <laughs> so you get a soundtrack to go with your drive really. Is that, is that a new addition on any Porsche? The sports exhaust, we have had it for a while. We have had it for a while as an option. Uh, more and more people seem to be getting into that though. Now they're specking that on the cars. I think it's just like the engine sound really. So it's an option on this? Yeah. Oh, right. So let's have that on. <laughs> we'll have that on. There we go. Yeah, if you're comfortable, mirror's okay for you. Sounds throaty, isn't it? Sounds nice. Yeah. yeah. Um, we'll head round to the right as well, around the back. And we won't meet anybody coming in there. I find the gear, gears, uh, gearbox is very precise as well. It's quite a smooth gear change, but very direct. You can have a short shift option on the car, but that is, that is a standard gear. So active suspension management it will be adjusting all the time to whatever's beneath the road wheels so we're trying to smooth out the ride trying to keep the grip level there um, in fact if I just put it on its firm setting there because it's a nice and even road this so that's on its firmest setting but it, you yeah. feel that oh, like don't, don't worry I'll put it back on its firm <laughs> yeah, yeah, setting yeah. well, I was going to say it'll blow your vision that <laughs> yeah. and then once again it smooths it out and it is a big difference Ride quality, but you certainly do feel the road even at this quality. You, you do. It's uh, if you need on road. I always tend to drive it on that that set. Yeah. I can't think of a time you'd need it on its firm set. Really. Probably on a track day or something like that. Right. Yeah. Just under four thousand revs. Fourth gear. 